We are very blessed. I want you to welcome here Skull Bay Surgeon, Dr. Harar Shahinian from the Skull Base Institute here in Los Angeles. And I, you know, that surgery was really cool to see. And I think it helped people realize why this is such a difficult area of the brain to get to. Correct. This is as deep as it gets. This is as deep as it gets. This is where the tumor is, in the deepest recess of the brain. This is the pineal region. And so you have this new procedure versus the old way. And let's show the old way versus the new way on this really cool animation that we have. Walk us through this. This is the old way, where you spend hours drilling large portions of the skull. Uh, sometimes five, six hours of drilling. Then you put metal retractors to either push the brain or sometimes even go through normal brain. In order to get to the tumor, uh, this procedure typically takes uh, eight to nine hours. You use uh, some fat to block the leakage of brain fluid. This is the new technique uh, done in two and a half hours, just like in this case. Patients leave the hospital within two days and the tumor is taken out completely through a keyhole very small opening with the help of a fiber optic, um, high definition, very small scope. So the pineal gland is now gone in entirely. This tumor is gone completely. In fact, let's show everyone. We have a before and after as far as MRIs of Krista's brain. Highlight for us where the tumor was in the before MRI image. This is the tumor. And again, this is in the very middle of the brain and then this is the after and what's missing? This is what's missing here. It's gone completely.